it's Bunny, and it's everybody's favorite day of the week. The day of the week when we ask ourselves, does this thing that you can barely see really work? Uh, yes, yeehaw, howdy, and uh, yippee ki -yay, Swamp Fam, because today we have possibly the weirdest, most extravagant item we've ever tested out here on my channel for Does This Thing Really Work? We have a workout machine all the way from Japan, and it's called Rodeo Boy. Now, I already unpackaged it, plugged it into the wall, because it came with no English instructions on the website. If you're anything like me, year after year, when January rolls around, every single year, I swear to myself, I'm gonna start exercising every day, I'm gonna get on a no cheeseburger diet, and every year I do fail. I'm always thinking to myself, well, if only I had a way to work out that made working out fun, then I would probably just get to it every single day. So about this time, every single year, I am online looking for all kinds of weird, like, exercise items. I don't know, just something that seems fun. So, uh, yeah, I found this thing. I'm a Texan at heart. I grew up going to the rodeo. I had things like Go Texan Day. If you're from Texas too, then you you know, you know what I'm talking about right now. Something that always really seems like a lot of fun to me is like bull riding or mechanical bulls specifically because like not real bulls. That just maybe seems questionable, but like mechanical bulls, you know, but like where do you find those? Where do you get those? It's not something you can order on Amazon. I've only gotten to ride a mechanical bull once in my life. No one cares about this. Do you guys know what Project Prom is? Do they even do that stuff anymore? Like, I feel like I'm starting to become so old and archaic that like just anything I've ever done in my life is now meaningless. It's like a sock hop. Like who, who does that anymore? Literally no one. But the only reason that I went to Project Prom was because they had a mechanical bull and I wanted to just do it at least once. Now that I'm remembering that life memory, on and around the mechanical bull, they had a lot of like um, inflatable padding. So if you fall, you didn't die. This machine has none of that. I believe when I ordered it on the website, the only thing it said is like, it's supposed to be like bull riding or mechanical bull. Somehow that is fitness you're supposed to only have to do it for three minutes a day. Sounds great. You guys, this little costume has been so fun for the intro and the thumbnail, but like, I feel like I'm about to be exercising. So I need to change. I need to like put my hair in a sassy bun or something. Take a sippy sippy. I'm very dehydrated under these lamps. And I'm sure I'm about to be doing a strenuous workout. I've never turned this machine on in my life. I have no idea what's about to happen. I'm just hoping I don't fall off. I would love this video to not end in hospitalization. Before I change, just take a look at my rhinestone cowboy boots. Yes! Can you see the sparkle? Can you see the sparkle? So sparkly. Can we get my face? Oh, finally! Okay, so um, there's many buttons. I'm gonna push the big giant orange one. And nothing happened. You guys, I'm terrified because um, I literally paid $700 for this thing plus $700 shipping. So just, what? Oh my God, why? Why? Oh, I think there's like a master button down there. Oh, okay. We have a red glowing light. Seems promising. I don't know like how much it moves around. I'm hoping just back and forth because if it starts to like, whoa. You know, like why is there a handle here? Am I gonna need this handle? Okay. Oh my God. Oh my god, it literally is like, oh, oh, this definitely needs some sort of inflatable stuff around it. Oh my, why is this so wild? <laughs> oh my god. <laughs> you guys, why is it getting wilder? Oh my, I know I keep saying, oh my god. I know it's probably like in the video looking like it's doing nothing. Am I getting the hang of it? But it almost feels like there's like, it's spinning on a gyrating ball or something. Like it's literally so challenging. And then it kind of gets a little bit calmer, I guess. <laughs> and then it just like does something crazy. Like you literally never know which direction it's gonna move next. There's like no pattern to it which maybe is more stimulating to the muscles because it's like your body just 
doesn't know what to prepare for? This definitely needs like a helmet or something though, you guys, because like, if you didn't have very good balance, like this would be so dangerous. Oh my God, and this is only on level one. There's, okay, what happens if I push the button again? Oh geez. Okay, so it does just faster, which somehow seems kind of easier. Like, I don't feel like I'm gonna fall off now. What sense does that make? You would think faster would be harder. Maybe it hasn't gotten to expert mode yet. Look, yippee taye. I could put on like a Western and just, oh geez, okay, I need to hold on. It's getting crazy now. Wait, you guys, I'm still somehow not on the most difficult mode. Oh geez, okay, I'm gonna push the button again because I'm just, completely chaotic. <laughs> it's like I'm trying to fall. <laughs> oh my god, okay. Oh, no. <gasps> okay, super hard mode. Oh my god, okay. I really was not ready for this. <laughs> oh my god, okay. Uh, oh my god, like the base? I feel like I'm being flung violently. <laughs> Woo! Oh my god, okay, okay. Oh jeez. It's like f flinging me? so hectically, right, that I feel the base shaking off the ground, and um, I don't think that's safe, you guys. This is honestly fun, though. But is it actually doing anything? Am I gonna get abs of steel like this? Because I'm not convinced, folks. It does just sort of feel uncomfortable, if I'm being honest, like my legs the chafing, I feel it happening. I need to like baby powder them or something. How do the real cowboys do it? With baby powder? Probably not like this at all. How does it look from out there, folks? Does it look like I'm getting fit? Look, I sound like I'm winded. Is that just a sad sign of my lack of physical prowess? Um, okay, let's just, just, okay, I'm gonna, I'm gonna slow it down. Yes, thank you. Oh God. Slower is harder. Slower makes me feel like death is any minutely, any minutely coming to me. Yeehaw. Okay, now it's gotten easier, but, <laughs> oh geez. Just as I said that. Dude, some of these motions that it all of a sudden just hits you with is literally like face planting. Face planting is the only thing that can come from that. Whew, all right. Why is it not on a three minute timer? It's, it, I've had to have been doing this for three minutes already, right? How long? Oh my God, okay, I'm gonna stop. Does this stop? Oh, yeehaw. That's a, that's a funny pose there, partner. Oh my God. Oh, my intestines are suffering. Oh my God, and my legs? Is this fitness? Is this what exercise feels like? How are so many people out there doing that every single day? <laughs> uh, anyway, you guys, let me know what y'all think about this. I wish I could say more. Like, I tried to do some extra research about this product. Maybe there are other shops and sites in Japan that have more information about this. If you live in Japan, uh, let me know, like, how common is a device like this. Like, Japan in my mind is just a magical place where everybody has a rodeo boy exercise machine in their house. Just, can you confirm or deny my suspicions on that? But yeah, I don't know. Like, testing devices out like this is literally what I live for because it's so weird. It's so strange. And it's so much fun. So yeah, let me know what you guys think about this. Oh my god. The lighting. I do feel like <sighs> really tired. I guess I've done some exercising. I don't know. Look at how weird it looks. Oh my god. <laughs> that looks like just so weird in motion by itself. What am I looking at there? It looks like a creature. Yeehaw! Um, anyway, I'm just gonna rodeo boy my way right on out of this video you guys but thank y'all so so much for watching and for all the support because it's because of you guys because of you guys watching my videos that's why we get to test out such funny crazy things here on the swamp now i love this thing but definitely 
The shipping cost is like the worst thing to me because honestly, $700 for a real piece of exercise equipment, I don't think is like too, too expensive, especially not something like really mechanical like this in my mind. How much are mechanical bowls? Could I have gotten one of those cheaper? Probably not. Also, why is there no such thing as a mechanical unicorn? Just imagine how many people would love to have that at parties, you know what I mean? Also, I feel like I'm getting quite efficient at this, yes? Uh, so leave me your comments down below. Do y'all want to see me uh, test more like quack exercise equipment, especially at the beginning of the year? But let me know, do you have New Year's resolutions that you know you're not gonna keep five minutes after the clock strikes midnight? Leave me them in the comments down below. I don't know why I'm like giving myself a thumbs down right now. Don't do that. Anyway, just, just, just let me know. Do you want to see more of this? Because I can find it. I can deliver more of this kind of content. Uh, anyway, you guys, thank y'all so, so much for hanging out today and for watching. If you're not already and you'd like to be, hit the button down below, subscribe, become a member of the Swamp Family, and give an alligator its wings. I love you guys so, so much. Also, don't forget, text me at the number down below, and uh, I think I'm going to do another giveaway very, very soon, so keep your eyes posted for that. Anyway, I love you guys, and I'll talk to you later. Happy trails, partner. Bye!